What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we are back at Farm Simulator 2017, baby. Woo! Ha ha! Just hanging out here on the Lost Island. Dun 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 dun. I don't know why I started singing the Conan theme right there, but it happened. And you know what? You just gotta own it. I hope everyone having, is uh, having a wonderful weekend. It is Saturday. Saturday. Oh, chickens! Hold on a second. I haven't picked up my eggs yet today, baby. Hello, eggs, chickens. You got some eggs for me, baby? You're doing a good job. I need more eggs, though. Eggs. 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 I, I'm i hungry and I need breakfast here, kids. Come on, ladies. Push them out. Push them out and do it. Put, uh, push it. Put, push it real good. Dun, 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 dun. Ow! Bum, 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 bum. Salt, 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 and pepper's here. Ooh, salt and pepper. That's good on eggs, too. Oh. I got bars. All right, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to grab uh, some bales quick because we need to make some quick cash. Just a little, little bit of a buffer. We're harvesting the field, the big field, at the moment. But we also have some grass here. We're just going to take some bales and we are going to load them up and sell them quick so we have some extra cash because today we're going to be getting into bales. They're everywhere! Ah, good old Tommy boy. We're gonna try something new today. So, there is a uh, mod. I'll put a link in the description uh, down below where you can harvest and actually create honey and sell it and it has your own sell point. Uh, I believe Daggerwind did a couple episodes on this on his Sandy Bay map. And I was like, well, if it's good enough for Daggerwind, it's good enough for me. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean, bro? It's a quality solid thing that he's doing. So why not uh, give it a try and see how it works and see how we can try to maybe, uh, I don't know, make it a little nutty, make it a little crazy. Now with the Lost Island map, this is what we're going to be trying to do. We're going to be, this is what we're going to be trying to do. We'll have uh, different kinds of mods and we're going to just have bank, we're just going to bankroll. Because when we're on the islands, man, you just want to, just want to relax. Do a little work, you got to stay busy, you know? But let's not kill ourselves here. We're on, va we're on vacation. I'm on vacation. So we don't want to get too nutty when it comes to... Comes to, comes to putting in work. We got beaches. We got yachts. We have lots of alcohol. Beautiful women. You know what I mean? Beautiful men. That's what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? Everyone here is beautiful. And they want their honey. So... That's what we're going to do today after I sell these bales. Now, I have a nice little area that I think would suit the entire operation. But I don't know how big things will get. But it's a good area. It's a quality area. I'm not going to use a, an actual field, per se. But... I think it'll be alright. Let's go ahead here. Back you up, buttercup. Beep, beep, beep. And. Wunderbar. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. Very good indeed. Yeah. Alright, so. Our harvester is doing work on the soybeans over here. We also have our field over there. Over yonder. How far is the yonder diesel? Um, a spell. So we'll take this and we'll unlatch you and we'll drive on, drive on over. Now I have purchased our uh, auto loading logging trail. Oh, we, we missed a bale. I did not see that. You can't miss a bale. Just like a meal, you can't miss a bale. How dare I? Thank you. So we purchased our auto-loading uh, log trailer. So that's over here. And we're gonna have to uh, manually, we don't have uh, any kind of like, uh, any equipment. And we're gonna have to saw down trees to make bee houses in our carpenter house. So what we do, get our placeables here. And here are all the bee molds. The molds for the bees. Bee house that produces honey to get production started. Now I don't know what the difference is between these two. Wait, hold on. This one is for handwork. Bee house that produces honey. To get the production started, deliver bee. 
This one's for handwork. I don't want a shed that gives me handwork. You know what I'm saying, bro? I mean, it's not a bad thing to have, but, you know, got to keep it PG. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, bro? You know what I mean? So we'll just use this one. So this is the carpenter. So we drop off wood to the carpenter. Carpenter then makes bee uh, be uh, little boxes, beehives, beehives, bee, bee boxes, bee box. No, a bee crate. And then we put those bee crates in here and then it produces honey. And then over here, if we uh, get some milk together, this one we can actually make honey milk and we can sell it here. Or we can just sell the straight up honey right here at this sell point. But right for now, since we don't have a whole lot of cash, a whole lot of cash, let's go ahead and we'll get the carpenter all up in our mix. So this is the area that I have. It's right next to the barn. So I figured why not take this and make it beautiful. And then we'll produce all the bees will be coming from this area right here. Let's go ahead and we'll plop that down. Murder. Beautiful baby. Let's go check it out. Oh no, Helper G's nearly full of grain. Oh no. So the carpenter, it's quite the mod. I'll put the link in the description. It's spiffy. Look at this. Loading zone. So we have to cut up the logs and we have to bring them into here. Where do we have Manuel? Manuel! Donde esta? Por qué? Hernando, mi amigo. Maria. Esta cuchicu. Por qué? So, <laughs> what is this here? Can you hear me? No, I can't because you have earmuffs on. Earmuffs. So, we uh, drop some wood into here. It then fills up. Once it gets to 100%, then uh, Miguel or Manuel. Manuel. Manuel? I'm sorry. Manuel or Miguel? Manuel. Manuel. He'll start going to work building the different boxes, and then they will produce out here. But look at all this little fun detail and stuff like that. You can grab onto anything. Hey there. Watch out. <laughs> Say, excuse me, please put my tools down. Gotta gr gr grinder. Excuse me, you want a grinder? There's a uh, shop, we, we call him the, uh, you know how the uh, show Seinfeld had the soup Nazi? In our uh, immediate area here in Allentown, there's a, uh, a sandwich shop, and we call him the sandwich Nazi, because he is exactly the same. He's like, what do you want? What do you want? You want grinder? You want hoagie? You want tiro? You want grinder? I'll give you grinder. So I always give him crap. Like, yeah, man, what's like a grinder? He's a nice guy. He's a nice guy, but he just sounds mean. You know, you ever meet those guys? Ever meet one of those guys where they're, they're a genuine person, they're just working hard, and they just have a certain way of talking, you know? And they're not being mean, they just have... You want grinder? Okay. You order, I make. Okay. You got it, brother. I will, t I will take a ham and cheese grinder. Very good. So let's go ahead and load this up so that we can get a move on here. You keep doing the good work, sir. You're doing a fine job. Just want to try that out to you. A fine, fine job. So these soybeans will be a nice little rack up in the bank department. I wonder how much they're going for right now, soybeans. Not, oh, for right now, Tia. Tia is one of them soys, yo. Tia is like, yo, hook me up with them soys. But Sparrow's place is looking kind of nice, too. I like that there's competition and lots of different places we can drop things so I don't have to make sell points and then get angry when the sell points don't work when I want to sell some stuff. And we're going to have honey, too. Not honey, do, but honey, too. <laughs> oh, oh, my bad. Sorry. Give him a little booty tap. Boo. All right, so we'll just leave that there for the time being. And do I have a chainsaw in this map? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. I don't think I do. So. We're just going to grab a couple logs here. I don't think we're going to need to cut down too many trees to get this whole thing a roll on. I think we just need to cut down like two, maybe three. If that. 
So, do I have... I don't have a chainsaw. Well, let's remedy that situation. Yeah, chainsaw. You know, I've always been a fan of... I've always used steel. When I was a landscaper, we always used steel. So, we're gonna have steel. All the weed whackers and everything. It always worked for me, man. It always worked for me and my crew. Ah, yes. So we'll cut that down there. We'll cut you down here. And even if we have more than what we need, at least we'll have extra. You know, it's always good to have extra. It's not always good to not have enough. Because then you're just making more work for yourself, at least when you plan out the work. It seems to work out for you. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and we'll just knock you off the... Knock you down. Don't bring me down. Whoops. Timber! Awesome. So, now we'll just have to groom them and then load them up. Alright, let's groom them. Pardon me. Coming through. You're beautiful. Make me beautiful, duets. Do, 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 do. Oh, you don't want to... Oh, what's the matter? You don't think you're special? You think you're special, huh? Let me tell you, you ain't special, Branch. You're just a branch. Branches ain't special. Although you're pretty. Alright, so let's cut you in half. Now we're going to need to saw these down because we actually have to carry... Wow, these logs are giant. Um, let's cut you down. Beautiful. And give it a good once. Give it a good one cut there. Awesome. I'll tell you what, we'll cut off the tips, just the tip, just to see how it feels. And mazel tov. Alright, let's go ahead and... Opa! I'm diesel in the oil today. Wunderbar! Alright, let's grab you. And how are we doing this? Right side. Right side, south side, worldwide. Uh uh uh. Can't stop, won't stop. Okay. Are they too big? I was gonna say, they shouldn't be too big for you. Oh, well, maybe they are. Maybe I need to cut them down. Hmm. Okay, well that one's big enough. That one's fine. What's the problem is? It is too big. Okay. That's fine. They're gonna get chopped down anyway. We gotta break them down. Alrighty. Alrighty then. Boom. And we'll just cut this right down the center. Ish. It's not exactly the center. It's center ish. It's a roundabout. It's a roundabout. It's a roundabout. Is this going to load in or what? There we go. That's the ticket. 
Now what's your problem? I guess you got a branch or something that's still attached, don't you? Yeah, 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 sure do. Hey, it vanished. Let's just make sure that these guys don't have... Yeah, yeah, there's a little... There's one branch. If there's one branch on here, on any... Anywhere on the log, it will not get picked up by the autoloader trailer. So you gotta make sure you groom them and trim them upright. Alright, so they look like they're... Uh, they, they look like they're... I. Let's go ahead and we'll lash this up for now. We'll be making a little maneuver. As in, turn around. Boom. Nice. Good. Boom, boom. Perfect. Stop the auto loading process. What if we could ride the beach? Take a ride on the beach, girl. You know that I love it, and I love you. Making up songs as a go, baby. I'm telling you, we should just drop these on iTunes. We can make so much cash. I could be a star. All right, lashes. All right, so we're going to take this, and we're going to start the auto unload. And we'll just dump them over here. And we should be A-OK -okay from there. All right, so where's our little piece? Where's our little join at? All right, just to... Take our little pencil point here. Don't worry about this; it'll glitch through the wall, uh, through here, and then we just drop it in there. As you can see, one percent already already done. Look at that, one percent. We're on centers here. But now we need to take stuff and cut it down. So give me a second here. I'm going to break some of this stuff down right now. It shouldn't take me too long, but it will take me some time to kind of break some of the stuff down for us into into pieces that I can carry. How about you? Can I pick you up? I sure can, because I'm strong like bull, my friends. Hello. My name is Diesel, and I'm strong like bull. Alright, 18%. See, it doesn't take too many It doesn't take too many logs to fill it all up. So it shouldn't take too long. We'll just keep on rolling here. If you're bored, just, uh, I don't know. Twiddle your thumbs while you're watching this. Or something else. I'm just playing. I'm not telling you to do that. I'm just saying you're probably already doing it. Oh, goodness. A hood. It won't take you too long as long as you do it the way that... There we go. 29%. All right, let's go ahead and we'll grab ourselves some more lags, logs, logs, logs. Logs for boys and girls. And it's pretty cool, too, because we'll have plenty left over for later. We'll have leftovers. It's like Thanksgiving dinner. We'll have plenty of turkey leftovers for everybody involved. Make some sandwiches. Make some wood sandwiches. Filled with honey. Because we'll be making beehives, get it? Yeah, you guys are a smart class. So, drag this over here. Pardon me, sir. Boom, boom. The sliding doors always remind me of. We going into a store. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Let's get you down. We'll cut down this log. This should do the trick. And we'll have plenty of logs left over for more beehives, which is which is pretty fantastic. Yeah, we'll cut it down here. Now, what I'll think about doing here is uh, maybe taking... Well, I mean, we're, we're fine with how it's working now. But this could be something of a tedious process if we get enough uh, beehives going. Excuse me. Pardon me. If we get enough beehives going, they're going to need more... Lo you know. Well, I mean... I'm trying to... Th I'm not really sure how they work, to be honest with you. So, we're going to learn on the fly here. Once we figure out how many of these things it takes to put together some stuff to put together to put everything together and how many beehive uh, things that Manuel here needs to create in order to fill up a beehive 
Like how many does it take to fill it all up? Can it be infinite? Do I need to do some stuff? Oh, okay, so that log is too big. All right. All right, look at that. Hey, hey, Manuel, I was I was sitting there, man. Okay. I'll tell you what, Manuel's hard at work, so that means we have to be hard at work, too. We work hard. We play hard, too. So let's go ahead. We'll cut some Frisbees off here. And fill it up till it gets about to 100%. I got splinters everywhere, man. Splinters everywhere, man. All right. So we'll just leave that there and eventually. See, look at this. I'll tell you what, man. This must have taken a little bit of time. He's a zombie, Manuel. He's a zombie carpenter. Braids. Bees. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, look at this, we're already making stuff. Got 11,000 right here. He'll go and grab a log. All right. He's running it through the planer. Is that what it's called? I think it's a planer. I don't remember if I recall from Woodshop. Uh, I don't know how he's cutting those things. Consider, oh, okay. <laughs> he was. I thought he was doing them long ways. I was like, why? I don't, I don't know, man. I don't think you're going to be able to cut like that. Very cool, though, man. So he's going to put together these. Where's your glue? Do you have a? Do you need widgets? Huh? Got to make sure you get your Bob Vila on, baby. So awesome. So now we're getting our beehive on. And that thing is getting put hard to work. And we have all these logs just in case uh, for future beehives. Nice. So eventually th this is going to rise up and become a beehive. We sh it will rise up. It, sh it shall be one. Um, but I don't know how long it takes. That I do not know. But it's nifty. I locks it. I like it. I like it a lot. So, oh, helper G is nearly full of grain. So let's leave that there for the time being. And we'll let Manuel do his work. He's a, why is his name Manuel? Well, it's just a name that flew into my head when he was picking uh, the grapes in our last map in Giant Island 2009. So now he's our carpenter. And if we decide we put we want to put a wine mountain again, which could be a thing. That's the wrong trailer. Uh, which could be a thing. Then we'll name that person something different. We sure will. But that's pretty cool, man. That beehive, the the bee beehive creator at least. Some hard work went into that, and it's kind of nifty, and it works. That's the most important part. Because I still haven't quite figured out how to get the whole pallet thing working with that the, the pallet works. We'll figure that one out too. But that would be kind of cool too for all the different kinds of uh, greenhouses and such. But we'll get those bees working, baby. We'll put those bees to work. Uh. Mm hmm. Let's go ahead and fill ourselves back up here. Halfway full. I've also got a couple mods here as well that are going to be dropping on the island pretty soon once we get some more cash. I found something that's pretty nifty. It's a, uh, you know I'm a grass man. I love me some grass mods. Uh, but there's a mod that, uh, all right, you'll fill up. We'll let you do some work here now, Tiger. There's a uh, mod that's a harvester. It's a mixture of a load, like a, a grass loader. Um, I'll show, I have to show you. It's a mixture of a grass loader and a harvester, and it's a mower. So it's three in one. 
three one. It looks like a harvester. It acts like a mower, and it stores grass in its uh in its booty. Let me show you. All right, so we'll head over here. It's in the harvester section. I don't know why. It looked like it could be in the mowing section, but check this out. It's case two. Okay, I'm sorry, not case two. Case International. Case IH. Agriculture. It's a mower. 179 grand. All it does is cut grass and the grass goes into the back. Has a capacity of 32,000. 60 horse 60 horsepower. That's one slow, slow harvester. This it is. 13 miles per hour. Top speed. Forage wagon collects grass, hay, or straw. It can also be filled with shaft. You damn right it can be filled with shaft. So it's a harvester, but it only is for grass. And that's pretty nifty. I want to try it out, but not today because it's super expensive and even to lease it is 14 grand and I'd rather save that money for a later time. Plus we have everything we need right now when it comes to the grass being mowed and all that whatnot and doodads and such and such. Plus we also have them before, I mean we have a, the grass, we got our grass baler. Where are we at here? There we are. See, I see we got our forge wagon. We got our mowers, we got our tipper, we got our bale wrapper. Everything's everything right here now, man. We do have to start doing some other things here as well. But all in all, it's pretty nifty. Am I right? Am I right, Case? Give it a hard case. Very, very cool. So, folks, that is going to be our episode for today. We're starting on the bees, getting after some honey, and soon we will be collecting that sweet, sweet nectar of the bees. Yeah, that's right, nectar of the bees. That's what it is. It's gonna be fancy. Let's go ahead and we'll latch this up here. All right, meow. Beautiful. It's beautiful, man. It's beautiful. So folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. It helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week, folks. Come on there, Manuel. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> he looks he looks funny. Everyone have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Peace out, life shout, y'all. And I will check you out right here again in Farm Simulator 2017, baby. Woo! Ha ha! Next time. This is pretty fancy. I'm just gonna take screenshots of this all day. Super cool, man. It's super duper cool. It's awesome.